Welcome to Wrestling Talk in the Shop, where we cover all things professional wrestling, from new wrestling to classic wrestling and everything in between. We go to wrestling, we do some wrestling, and everything in the ring. Hey guys, it's John with Wrestling Talk in the Shop, and welcome back to the channel. With SummerSlam fastly approaching, I thought it'd be cool to go back and look at some of the old uh, SummerSlam elites and... Uh, First off, we're gonna start with 2020, and this is uh, Viscera. We're gonna review and look over the whole uh, the whole series here. Not really one major figure one in this line that everybody was wanting was the Fiend, and, and uh, we're gonna take a look at it. It was the first Fiend figure of that year, but anyway, we got Viscera here. He's built from Harlem, New York. You get a little fuzzy. Yeah, I've had these a while. His weight was 487 pounds. Hardcore champion, tag team champion, 1995 King of the Ring. Visa, He's got the hardcore championship title belt. Man. Is it in there? Mm hmm. Yeah. Visitor represented the corporate ministry along with his partner Midian in the SummerSlam 1999 tag team turmoil match. He also won King of the Ring, and uh, that was probably the highlight of uh, Visitor there. But you can turn around. Like I said, these are old. They're a little dusty. They've been on the wall for a while. I pulled them down to do this video. And that's not really a good head scan of Visitor if you can go back and look at it. It doesn't really look like him. I mean, you know, they've come yeah. a long way since then. Yeah, so, I mean, you can tell it's him. You can but. tell it's him, but it's not really the best the head scan. But then we got uh, the rowdy one herself, Ronda Rousey. Built from Venice uh, Beach, California. Five awesome. foot seven. Her finisher is the arm bar. Career highlights the Raw Women's Championship. At SummerSlam 2018, Ronda Rousey beat Alexa Bliss for the Raw Women's Championship and proved why she is the baddest woman on the planet. And she's rocking her iconic look with, they even got the eye makeup on her. Yeah. That she came out with. She was looking, she was looking pretty fierce then. And she's they've on. even got her hair braided up like yeah. she had it. She's had several figures, but. Yeah, yeah got, got that several. white championship belt. Yeah, that's the uh, Raw version. You know, now it's, now it's, now the Raw is the World Heavyweight Champion. We'll see Ronda again someday and, uh, WWE, she'll be back. She's on a hiatus right now. She's uh, busy being a mom. Then we got the phenomenal one, AJ Styles. Built from Gainesville, Georgia, 218 pounds, five foot 11. Career highlights, WWE champion, United States champion, representing the original, uh, the official, the only club that matters. AJ Styles successfully defended his US champion against Ricochet at SummerSlam in 2019. He's got his gloves on. Yeah. They need to bring AJ cool. Styles' original music back. I mean, that music, I mean, that one, he's got some whack music out there now. But uh, AJ, he's, he's in Japan right now with Jordan Grace. I like Jordan Grace too. Yeah. She'll be in WWE before you know it. Oh yeah. Moving around along, we have the highlight of the series, The Fiend Bray Wyatt. Uh, weight 285 pounds, six foot three inches tall. Career highlights. Universal Champion, WWE Champion, Raw Tag Team Champion. When Finn Balor challenged The Fiend at Bray Wyatt to a match at SummerSlam 2019, he found out how dangerous it was to let him in. And now you got Bo Dallas and the, uh, what are they, White Six? Yeah, going yeah there. White He's, Six. I figure we'll have a Bo Dallas versus Chad Gable match at SummerSlam. Yep, he's got his lantern and yeah. his gloves and extra set hands. I remember this was pretty hot. Hot, pretty hot commodity when it come out. I mean, then we got, yeah, I like that. I mean, this week I, they released this same figure several times. Moving right along, you can probably still see this one on shelves. I still see it sometimes. Yeah. Miss Elizabeth from Louisville, Kentucky, as manager of the Mega Powers, the first lady of, uh, and wife, uh, first lady of WWE, had an itsy bitsy tweeny, teeny weeny surprise for the Mega Bucks at SummerSlam in 1988. That's when she pulled her skirt up. That was sort of unheard of. You can see there is sort of a picture of her doing it. That was unheard of in 1988, you know. Of course, now we see that every week on TV, basically, but, you know. A little Ms. more Liz risque yeah. back then. Miss Elizabeth, she truly was a, the first lady of professional wrestling. I mean, but, you know. Yeah, it, like rural Walmarts and stuff, you can definitely still find those, yeah. which yeah, is Ms. crazy. Miss Elizabeth's still on the shelf. Then we got the ravishing one, Rick Rude from Robbinsdale, Minnesota. Weight 252 pounds, six foot three inches tall. Career highlights, the Intercontinental Champion, WCW United States Champion, WWE Hall of Famer inductee. Whether he was wooing the ladies or taking care of business inside the ring, Rick Rude showed 
the WWE Universe what it means to be truly ravishing. He was also WCW International Champion. I don't know how you how you recognize that, but uh, he was a WCW World Champion, too. I so mean, he's got, like, a jacket in here. Yeah. And, like, they have the Intercontinental title printed on his... Uh, I think he, yeah, he beat the Ultimate Warrior on his with the Bobby Heaton at uh, SummerSlam. So, I mean, he's, yeah, see, it's printed on his pants. Yeah. Rick Rude, he was, he was a good one. We lost him too soon. You can see the side pictures there. I love these old packaging. You can see the whole figure. Now you get like a small window. Oh, yeah. Here. But uh, there you have it. And uh, we'll do more of these videos. But uh, there is the, uh, the whole lineup there. Like I said, the best ones, in my opinion, probably uh, The Fiend and uh, Rick Rude, just because I like Rick Rude. You know, we get tons of in Viscera. We don't have a lot of Visceras, but... Uh, you know, we get uh, tons of AJ Styles. There's been tons of uh, Ronda Rousey's, but uh, tell us your favorite one in the comments. Let us know what you think. Like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching, guys.